The lap mount is a very easy, quick release. Earlier I mentioned when talking about sheet bends that when you make one, a sheet bend that is, you can make a quick release. Let's take a look at that real quick. Back up through the bite. Even though it does make a nice quick release, it has the downside of still being attached to the loop. So an easy solution for that is the lap knot. And for this one, you want to fix the loop, such as this angler's loop or a bowline or anything of the sort. And you actually want to lie, lay your line just across it, right on top. Come back around. And now we're going to take a bite and put it up through the rest of the loop. Making sure to tighten down on itself. Now this is the type of thing, depending on what you're using it for, you can have as little or as much strain on it. It holds, I've used this for snare traps, you know, the two, you know, maybe an inch and a half, two inch sapling bent over, and that held that just fine, so it can definitely hold quite a bit of pressure, no problem. Uh, I don't know if I'd use it for body weight or anything of that kind of thing, but definitely useful. But the advantage here is, when it does come out, let's see if I can show you this kind of slow, it actually releases the entire loop and isn't bound to it at all. Let's see if I can show you that again. <clears throat> With your fixed loop, just lay a line on top of it, go back around, and bite up through the loop. <clears throat> and again, this can be however as long as you want. It makes no difference. See if I can't show you like this. As you can see, it just breaks away without actually being connected. So that one works quite well, opposed to the sheep end quick release. Do that one more time. Over itself. back behind it, and then take a bite and go up through the other loop. And again, I'm doing this a little exaggerated so you guys can see, but then just tighten down. And I'm going to have to quick and easy, quick release.